on 16 by 9. Voila. They call it Circus NASA. Bruises and muscle soreness, <laughs> blood or ribs, it's, it's all normal part of our days. It's a Cirque du Soleil training ground. The weirdest, the wildest, and the best in the world. Do anything and everything for a chance to get to perform on this stage. If you've ever stepped inside the world of Cirque du Soleil, you will know it's mystic intoxication. A place where the imagination is in overdrive, where the circus meets the abstract, and where audiences clamor. One hundred million people have taken in the experience, and as we learned, it's a performance as entrancing for those who watch it as it is for those who aspire to be a part of it. Cirque is like the epitome of entertainment, like it's, it's the top. I think Cirque du Soleil um, best of the best in the world. I want it really bad and it's, it's one of my dreams. Every year that dream becomes one step closer for an elite group of athletes who arrive here. At Cirque's headquarters on the east side of Montreal. They call this place Circus NASA, a creative hub as otherworldly as a Cirque production. Shows are conceived here, Costumes are hand sewn and careers are built. You keep the focus. Behind the scenes, Cirque has the biggest casting department in the world. Scouts in eight different disciplines scour the globe, looking for gymnasts, singers, dancers, actors, talented enough to make it onto a Cirque stage. In effect, the company operates like its own agency, compiling a roster of talent to draw from at any moment. Well, weaved into the choreography of six current productions, you'll find traditional martial arts, free running, parkour, and inline skating. Early on, it's easy for the scouts to see there is only one real standout. A Wushu gold medalist, Sang Muk Oh, who has traveled all the way from Seoul to try out. It's the guys who are stumbling when it comes to this. Dance class. Hey, don't forget, you know, you didn't come to Cirque du Soleil to become dancers. They may not have come here to be dancers, but this class, like several others, is mandatory for anyone in Cirque's general training. The point is to gauge their coordination and skills and build the base to work from should they be cast in a show. You guys have a lot of Five, six, seven, stop! Let go! Now dance for me! The fact of the matter is neither Justin, Trisha, nor Andrew has ever studied dance. I see myself in the mirror and I'm like, you shouldn't be doing this. And so fair to say hanging sideways on a pole is an easier task than this. I just made sure I had five coffees before <laughs> to be ready for it. You just come in and it's like, 
bang straight away you're leaping around and you've got yeah Massimo screaming and swearing Swear. a lot yeah <laughs> of course there are professional dancers in Cirque du Soleil but they too come from a specialized world with its own set of grueling standards to find them you have to go to a Cirque dance edition not to be what we, you think that we need to have or what we're looking for, but actually be what you are. Of the hundreds who have shown up at this open audition in Montreal, only a handful will make it to the end and into Cirque's talent data bank. Then you go one, two, three, four. The man with their careers in his hands, Giulio Scatola, dance scout for Cirque du Soleil. We're looking for the, the pearls of the world. We're looking for the diamonds in the rough. Julio's team will look at hundreds of dancers every year. And so the slightest millimeter in a hand position or extension can make the difference between a yes and a no. All right, here we go. Showtime. Before him, eager, young, limber dancers. Reach out, reach out. Reach out. Moving seemingly effortlessly through intricate choreography, all trying to impress. I just went out there and did my best, and we'll see. Sometimes even the most unthinkable moves still aren't enough. We're going for the dancers that fit the closest to the profile that we need now or in the near future. Come day two, hundreds are down to only 30. All right, should we start? Here we go. They get the chance to try out some original choreography from Cirque's production Whoa. of the Beatles' Love. Intricate, incredibly fast, and leaving no margin for error. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Keep in mind, dancers normally do all of this for a job. This is merely a chance at a job, and getting into that golden data bank. That list is very a very coveted space to be, I think. It is long, but everyone on it is extremely, extremely talented. So you're in kind of Cirque's inner circle in a way. So it's, I mean, it's an amazing place to be. To get there, the demands are exceptional. Okay. So I'm gonna ask you to do, if you can, in underwear. In underwear? Um, All right. The narrowing group is pushed even further, tested on acting. Now one is Spider-Man and the other one is Batman. <laughs> and improv. At the end of two exhausting days of sweat and hope, a once crowded room is left with four. It's over. You're in. Thank you, guys. Says, you are now part of the Cirque du Soleil bank of potential performers for roles on our current shows and upcoming creations.
of the beautiful things about being a dancer is you share that vocabulary and you share an understanding of your body. The further we go with art, the more evolved it will be as far as choreography and the, um, the way in which a piece is set up. I wanted to show the calmness that can be displayed in your everyday life of repetition. I think everyone can dream big. It's our hope that we identify new talent. Improvise first. Emerging choreographers, emerging designers, emerging directors. And it's, it's the opportunity for many to be seen. The choreographer showcase gives them the opportunity to, to do what they really want to do. I love the process of creating, of, you know, sort of kind of being obsessed with an idea and mashing and mashing it out until it makes sense. Three, from here, you just finish, you're going to turn this body down, up, down, up. From PA, and two, and three, and four. We are trained dancers, performers, acrobats. Beautiful, amazing. Sharp movements. Strong movements. Movement vocabulary. Classical dancers. They work the body beyond physical experience. It's so intense. The schedule is intense. Organized chaos. <laughs> Being thrown into such different styles, it's crazy. <laughs>